Students from UC Davis are the most intelligent and the most passionate people I've ever met. And I just know that we, like we're going to change the world and we're going to make it better. And these problems that we're facing that somebody has to address is going to be us. Global Education for Our Big Idea is a phenomenal way for us to change the way the campus thinks, operates, engages students, faculty, and staff. What the Global Education for All is aiming to do is to reach 100% of the students. So not only undergraduate, but actually also graduate and professional students. We want each and every student at UC Davis to have a global education. And in order to do that, we need philanthropic support. We have an opportunity to do something incredible at UC Davis, and we need the broader community of friends engaged because what we're trying to do involves providing every single UC Davis student, regardless of their financial background, with an opportunity for global learning. The major problems, challenges of our times are very much global in scale. Um, and UC Davis is really committed to graduating students that are prepared to proactively work on those challenges and also take up the kinds of opportunities that are available to us now in this increasingly interconnected world. We're really lucky here at the Vet School to have faculty engaged all over the world. So you have opportunities to do research, to do outreach, to do clinical medicine pretty much on every continent. Um, and I was really lucky to organize a summer research experience in Rwanda. And I worked with Gorilla Doctors, which is a partnership between our very own UC Davis and the Mountain Gorilla Veterinary Project. They provide health care to endangered mountain gorillas. And so I had the great privilege of spending some time in Rwanda working with this great ape species that I feel like really passionately about. In this past year, my final year as a senior, I was working kind of as a project manager. So I was overseeing our three active projects. Our Peru project, our Indonesia project, and our Bolivia project, where we implemented a reinforced concrete reservoir and about a mile of piping to get water to the new reservoir and into the community. A few quarters ago, I took a GIS class on campus, and it was really interesting being able to learn the basics of mapping. But I felt like I needed to apply it and put it towards something that I'm more passionate about and I decided to apply for the Nepal Seminar Abroad because of the intercultural and interdisciplinary aspect of it. So we were able to work with students in Nepali universities and we were also able to work with students in Davis from different majors such as like pre-med, engineering, linguistics, and design. So those are like students I would probably never like work with. Collaboration is critical. The global challenges that the world is facing requires that our students have certain understanding of intercultural perspective, of global context within which these global challenges take place. And as a result of the solutions, are going to require that we engage partners from all over the world. So we're helping uh, faculty to make sure that they really have means and tools and, and resources to bring global learning into their classroom. We want to integrate and expand the international and global dimension in our curriculum. New courses, courses that actually emphasize the international and global component and that are comparative in nature with other countries and other cultures. There's that opportunity for students to be collaborating with each other, for them to be learning from faculty who are based elsewhere, who can bring new perspectives to bear upon work. So that's a really powerful type of learning opportunity that doesn't require any student mobility. We want to create new living and learning communities in our dorms. So whatever students are learning in the classroom, it's actually taken outside of the classroom and brought to their daily life in the dorms where they live. As an international student, I have realized that I want to be involved with both international and American students on campus. And I've gone through that, through getting involved with the global ambassadors who are in charge of providing social, cultural, and intellectual needs for incoming international students on campus. You tend to improve both your creativity and critical thinking when you're working with people from different backgrounds, and I see that both in the classroom and outside of classroom. 
The Mandela Washington Fellowship Program is for young professionals in Sub-Saharan Africa. They come to America, different universities. It's a professional development program, educational experiences, and I worked with UC Davis Global Affairs as a communications intern, capturing the journey of the fellows. And we visited public agencies, government officials. There were educational sessions with UC Davis professors, professors from outside of the university. And it was a very unique educational experience. Global learning gives students a way to experience the real world. It gives students a perspective on a new culture, a new way of life. It feels really good that somebody else decided to donate so that I could have an opportunity to grow as a person, to try and help somebody else, and to make the world a better place. 